Hot, dry weather is not just uncomfortable, it can be dangerous. Cynthia Newsom talked, to, Newsom talked with a Johnson County farmer worried about his fields and the upcoming holiday. The fire hazard is every day is getting worse and worse. Walk through Tom Bame's wheat field and you can't help but notice how dry it is. This ground a week ago had one and a half inches of rain on it mm -hmm. and you can't tell it. The wheat is already harvested. This is what's left, wheat stubble. All I had to do was bend it in half and it easily broke. That worries Tom because homes are close by and soon children could be playing with fireworks. Say if we don't get a rain by the 4th of July, all it's going to take is one of the fireworks and it's gone. A few years ago, he was in a combine on one of his fields when he noticed smoke and then realized it was a fire. We never did see where they came from, but the field started on fire and the fire department determined that it was fireworks. Fire danger is not his only concern. Corn is his cash crop. And Farmer Bain tells me if it doesn't rain and soon, he could lose his entire harvest. That would not only affect his bottom line, it could affect yours too. The livestock feeding industry, that means they're short of corn. That's going to cost them more. If corn goes $10, it's going to cost them more to feed out fat cattle and within turn they're going to have to get more money out. All Farmer Bain can do now is keep working and keep hoping that rain will come, rescuing his thirsty crops and reducing the risk that one 4th of July firecracker could set his dry fields on fire. Cynthia Newsom, 41 Action News. And livestock is also affected by the current conditions. Many ponds that provide water for cattle are dangerously low and could dry up unless we get more rain.